Good morning, Oak Park School. Today is Thursday, February 3rd, 2022. Our special student guests for this morning news are Selena and Franchi from Dr. Holmes' class. At this time, would you please stand and face the flag for the Pledge of Allegiance? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the province which is stand, one nation, under God, and visible and liberty and justice for all. Would you please remain standing for our Panther Pledge? Today, I will be respectful, on tax, accepting, and responsible. I'm Old Park Panther. Hear me roar. You may be seated. Thanks for helping out this morning. We will now take some time to pause for a moment of silence. Use this time to slow down, relax, and reflect on your day ahead. The wonderful folks with the Literacy Lab continue to share videos every Thursday. Grab your lab coats and let's see what they have in store for this week. Good morning, Ms. Peters. Thank you for joining us today. How are you doing? I'm quite fine, thank you. What book will you be sharing? And why did you put this book? I chose Fad Rats by Eric Jockman because it's a family favorite and in all honesty I had a hard time choosing a favorite book because I have so many and my boys at home told me to bring this one in. Interesting. How would you summarize this story? This is a story about a little rat named Josiah and his little artist friends who are told they are bad rats for following their hearts and using their imaginations. And their professor, Professor per Perimeter, he, in the end of the story, is reminded by Josiah that it's okay to follow your heart. It's okay to be messy and have an imagination. And he was trying to chase his dreams. Yes, I would agree. He was trying, Josiah was trying to chase his dreams. How did reading this book make you feel? This book made me feel a little bit sad because they were told that they were bad for following their hearts. And that's not true. And it was happy in the ending because Professor Perimeter was taught by his little rat friends here, his students, that it's okay to be messy, to follow your hearts, and have an imagination. Thank you. How did this book influence and change your life? This book influenced or changed my life because it was a reminder for me to allow my boys at home to ha be creative and imaginative and allow them to follow their hearts and chase their dreams as well. Thanks for sharing this, your book with us today. Enjoy your day. Thank you. Have a happy Christmas. You too, bud. Wonderful stuff. Loved hearing about bad rats. We'll close things out this morning with our Throwback Thursday, a time where we highlight a famous event that happened on this date in history. On this day in 2002, the New England Patriots shocked football fans everywhere by defeating the heavily favored St. Louis Rams, 20 to 17. It would be the first of Tom Brady's seven Super Bowl victories and five Super Bowl MVP awards. Brady officially announced his retirement on Tuesday after 22 seasons. Brady is the all-time leader in passing yards, touchdowns, and quarterback wins. Love him or hate him, he will end his career as the greatest of all time. We hope you have a great day, Panthers, and like always, continue to roar.